these persons who were indicted for war crimes were betting that the international community would never have the skill to capture them. And for the first year and a half, they were lulled into that because, in fact, the international community didn't have the skill. But when Prime Minister Tony Blair was elected, he went to President Clinton and said, I just don't think we can live with this peace agreement without justice. At that point, the president basically made the decision, we're going to do everything possible to go after those targets. The unit of choice for the United States to go after these very specific individuals was Joint Special Operations Command. The National Command Authority decided that the unit would be the best organization to execute these manhunt operations for NATO. Why? Number one, we're the highest trained tier one force in the US. Two, we know how to blend into civilian places so we can conduct tactical level reconnaissance surveillance. And three, this mission was a capture mission, not a kill mission.